Welcome to Backwards News. Rants you can trust. Warning, this is a rant channel. All persons in this video are real and the events are factual. Satirical speech may be used to comment and criticize on subjects. Good morning, good night, good evening, wherever you may be, Tokyo, Japan. This is Al's Backwards News. If the story is backwards, I'm going to bring it to you. You made it to the latest edition. Thank you, thank you. Who is this man? He looks like a wise professor or some kind of smart guy. Did he in invent the cell phone? He did something special. Well, he's a old, dirty bastard. That's right. Old, dirty bastard. Retired police captain Curtis Reeves. He's crazy as hell. And Florida, Florida man, Florida man, Florida man, in Florida, in 2014, he, he killed a man, the ex-police, he killed a man, and he been ducking and dodging, talking about, I, I'm the police, no, you're not, you retired. He killed a man. He'd been ducking and dodging court. He's supposed to make it to court this month, February the 7th, if everything work out right. He walking into these hearings with his cane, talking about his foot hurt everything. But we, we finally got his ass. We are going to see if we can put him in jail and let him finish out his police retirement in jail. In 2014, Florida man, 79-year-old retired Curtis, went to the movie theater. And his ass is so fucking crazy and backwards. He arguing with a man that's on his phone. He tell how do, what's wrong with you? He telling the man get off your phone. Well, fucking fuck you. So he arguing with somebody with a man named Chad Olson, forty three years old. He at the movie theater with his wife. Motherfucking Captain Reeves, retired captain, tell him get off the phone. He said, man, fuck you, you old dirty bastard. They start arguing. The Mr. Olson grabbed his popcorn, grabbed Reeves' popcorn, took it from him, then threw it in his face. Retired Captain Curtis Reeves pulled out his pistol and blew his ass away, killed him in the damn movie theater. The police came. They arrested this fool. This foolish old dirty bastard. He was arrested, arrested in 2014. They haven't figured out what they're going to do with him. He's been ducking and dodging. Your ducking and dodging is over with. It's time to go to court. It's time to get them bologna sandwiches going. They got him out on bond $150,000. With a tether on his leg. He didn't have a tether on his leg for, for eight, nine years to wore the batteries out. Wore the batteries out. I ain't good. <laughs> yeah, I'll buy some, some Ever Ready. I, I don't care. As long as I don't have to go to jail. Uh, Chris Nock, Nocco, Norco, something, Nocco, of the Peso County Sheriff's Office. When the shooting happened eight years ago, they said, what's wrong with him? Why is he crazy? Why is he, what's wrong with, with Mr. Reeves? He said, I cannot tell you 
what's wrong with him. All I know is he shot the man because he refused to stop texting on his telephone. Crazy time. Backwards. Backwards news. Got to be kidding me. So we about we about to do this. His ducking and dodging is over with. Okay, tell me, what would you do? What would you do? Is it okay to blast people at the movie theater? Or should you move to the next seat? What should you do? Can you please stand your ground at the movie theater? Or should you just go get some popcorn and go to the next seat? Should this old man go to jail? He said he was scared. Because that popcorn hit him in the face. He didn't know what was going to happen next. So he had to stop the threat. That popcorn hurt his face, his feelings. What should we do? Comment, tell me. Defund the police. We got a jail cell ready. We got that orange is the new black jumpsuit ready. And your bologna sandwich is waiting. Your green bologna sandwich is waiting. We need you. Come on. We need you. We have lots of vacancies. So we're going to see what's going to happen. I'll get back with you on the next edition of Backwards News.